old and I'm just turning the sound on and off, it's fine. Yep. But we have heard and will hear here plenty of uh, this opening. <laughs> That's a nice tower you got there. Mm -hmm. A shame if something happened to it. It sure would. Which one is that? I don't know. Mountains on one side, grass on the other. I think there's a beach up there. Powered it down. A tower and golden sun. Oh. It's not the Mercury one, because the Mercury one was in snow. But can't I, you know, I've eliminated one of the towers. Thank you, Mr. Sarcasm. I believe the Mercury one was also like surrounded by water. Venus and Jupiter? Yeah, like the two we haven't seen yet, I think. No. Wait, can we see the. We have seen the Venus. Uh, like, is it the Venus one? Hmm. Well, if it is the Venus one, that one's split in two. Yeah, Mars is the other one we haven't seen along with you. I don't know. I don't know which one that is. Interesting questions. Maybe we'll visit the topography of the Jupiter one and be like, hmm, maybe that one? Alright, so, uh, Doc had his, uh, marathon yesterday, so he might still be unconscious. Don't know if he's gonna join us today, but, uh, otherwise, we're, we're gonna play more Golden Sun, Lost Age. We did Gaia and Aqua Rock last time, so we got Sand and Parch. Uh, finished the trade quest with a turtle. Did some other, like, random things in some towns here and there. Uh, off stream I did go and unrust the three weapons we picked up. I believe, uh, I believe I kept two of them. One of them, uh, wasn't better than anyone's weapon. Which I was like, oh, oops, yeah, that's swords. It was like the robbers something and it wasn't, uh, yeah, uh, both Felix and, uh, Sorry, Dumba and Alvis had better weapons. So that got sold. <laughs> I believe the Demon Mace and another staff we got were better. I'll probably see that when we, uh, we pop in. Uh... Load up. So, yes, the Demon Mace was better than Dumba's sword, which got sold. Uh, the Draco Mace, yep, here we go, was, uh, was better than what Fiora had on. Yes. And, no, uh, it was better than the Glower Staff, which I then gave to Charles, because that was better right, than what right. she had on. And Alvis still has the, uh, Cloudbrand. Cloudbrand is going to be pretty good for a while. It was sorted inventory. The other thing we did was we started playing around with uh, some gin, so... We're gonna fuck around and find out. <laughs> so think about the, the classes that are given by items is that they require uh, three different types of gin, the off-brand ones for yes. each person. So Jenna has to have, I believe if we'd, uh, Tamer was the first level, then Trainer was the second, if we had one of each. Yep. But two of each, we now are a Beast Keeper, and that looks like some good shit right there. We have so many new friends to meet. Uh, <coughs> currently, Dumba is a Brute. 
uh, with four Mars on, so, uh, he has, he has some, you know, decent stuff here, you know, pretty alright. He can explode. And it, we've ended up putting the revive one on, uh, on Alvis and just, uh, stand firing it, so back to being a commander, so he has ply. Yes. Um, and Charles has ended up in a really weird place, but she's now a divider, so she has some cures, she's a bolt. She can do some blasting. If we find another Mars Genie, we should be in okay shape for, uh, Alvis. Alright, so the first thing we're doing is we're going back to Izumo, because there were some ruins in there where we're like, oh, the good thing to get in there requires parts, which we yep. do not have yet. So both Aqua and Gyrock require you to have both in order to get everything. Yes, some Apoji stuff from the requires other. requires sand in order to get a shin. Yep. Uh, and Izumo requires Parch in order to get something else. Not a genie, but, uh, something else that's given. Both in the towns that are around the rocks, basically. <laughs> Having to actually go into the menu to do that is gonna kill me. Um, but, uh, if you don't mind, I'm just gonna zoop. Yes, well, we're gonna do some zooping because, <laughs> boy howdy, we have sailed on this ocean. Yeah, we don't, we don't need to do it without fast forward at the moment. We've, seen, we've been here before. We are begun, we're basically going to be going pole to pole like twice yes. today. Yes, because I'm going up and then I think I'm just going straight I back down. Think to so, yes. Tower, <laughs> which is all the way in the south. So like, we just, yep. all right. Unfortunately, I think the, no, no. They don't fit. No, they don't fit. They don't fit. They don't fit. <laughs> Trapped forever, you've moored the boat. <laughs> Found a new soft lock. <laughs> I forgot the week. Here. <laughs> Alright, so let's go to Izumo. They're Adios. still dancing. Doing. Yeah, playing it on a cart without fast forward is definitely. Uh... Much. Oh, how do I get down? I think there? it's actually down on the lower end of the rock. You can go down and around. Yeah. I think it's like. The move. I, I got this. stuck on him too. Yes, I don't know if we have to have to, but it won't hurt. I mean, we've all beaten it on cartridge. Uh, I mean, at least I have. I think yep. Doc did. Probably several times. We know. Alright, so yeah, the problem is that we could come here and we need sand here. Yes, because um, it's the only way to get through here without pounding. So yeah, we came here before going to Guy Rock. was like, ah. We need sand. Uh, and then I looked at the guy when we came back and I realized that we also need parch. Mm. Uh, so we decided to leave. Back. It's kid patience and also kid car trips. Yeah. Don't underestimate. Well, I could really play um, games uh, on car trips. I, I protect, I've probably mentioned this before. I get extremely motion sick. Mm -hmm. uh, I cannot uh, play games for long in a car. I usually try to, and then you know I do it for like twenty minutes, thirty minutes, and then realize, oh, I don't feel very good. That was a that was a mistake. I should not have done that. Mm -hmm. uh, so I can't read. I can't do very much. I just sleep in cars. Yep, I can attest to that. Wee! Oh, I always press I always press R for a map. Mm -hmm. Probably just a blade. Yeah, there's like one new enemy in here. Yeah, so I because of that I you know it's it's not a car trip game for me, but it was it the first one in particular was a um uh, on holiday without my computer, without my video game consoles kind of thing, because, you know, back in the day, we didn't have smartphones, <laughs> and you, you basically, the only thing I had was the, uh, the GBA or whichever. Aha, I yeah. see. I see how, it, how it's a full thing. All right. In other words, it's pounding time. Not quite high enough level for a boy to be working. <laughs> <coughs> Fighting these fuckers till the end of time. 
Yeah, I, I would try reading car. Of course, nowadays I have the problem if I, I read on my smartphone in a car and I feel terrible. Mm -hmm. I really should just not do that. Family wishing. Yep. Hop off. It's sad, honestly. It's so the, tough to say how I get the feeling are, we're but... going to be using sad <laughs> quite a bit today. Yeah. Learning spells, we do have Nova. Yes, yes, yes. And more right. importantly, so yes, Fairy is 120 HP, Elderwood is 170 party wide. Oh, wow. Ooh, that's super very rich. Good. Huh. Well, those are single Taria. Let's yep, try yep. Chimera. Here we have uh, Bolt Moves. And, you know, Alvis is pretty much the same. Alvis Summon is just Alvis. Friends! <laughs> Oh, it spins down too. They're all gonna spin in, and it's great. Ah. All right. Ah, there we go. So we'll just have to yoink that over. Oh Ooh, my God, wow, Knifeman! Oh, big friend. I think he's the new one, at least for this area. Ah, so we have yep, Aggressor. Let's try out Griffin here. Mad growth. Yeah, it's mad growth. I do love Planet Diver. Yeah! Whoa, Jesus! So that's good. That seems decent. <laughs> that wasn't even that wasn't super, super effective, effective, so uh, neat. <laughs> Noted. Oh, shit! <laughs> Get dunked, okay. Russell. That was like 10 PP, too. That was yeah. like. Not that expensive. Oh shit! All right, let's uh, put that in the back pocket. A little bit, a little bit. Keep that in mind. So I guess we have to come around this the other way. Yes. All right. Yes. Yeah, so the class items upgrade, but the upgrade really weirdly, which is and I don't why. know if the game ever tells you that no. you have to give them three like genie of the other three elements yes. to upgrade them. So um, I uh, Dumba here would need um, Mars, Mercury, and Jupiter uh, rather than the Venus ones. So it is like it's really weird, but I feel like we're gonna do. I mean, this team is fucking great, and mm -hmm. then we're probably gonna do another class item on someone. Mm -hmm. Um, and then once we get the other two, um, it'll be a bit easier to have, like... Like, Dumbo being a brute is pretty good. That's 350 attack. You should know it's 348 on Fiora with Beast Keeper. Um, but brute is pretty strong, so... Yeah, yeah the game doesn't tell you anything about how to get <laughs> classes. Yeah, like, it is... I had no idea that class items upgraded, and then it... Because who does this? Who puts, right? like... This is sinful right now. Who puts three in? Like basically, in one you were, you you kind of realized you wanted basically all of one on somebody for the most part. But even this brute one is like it's for Mars, and the, these Venus ones here don't matter. It could be anyone, and he'd be a brute. Yep. Like three way mixes were not a thing in one at all. It was like two at max, and for the majority of the game. It was really just one. Yeah. And then at the end, it would be like, oh, if you have four and two, you know, you'll turn into this. Of these specific ones, you'll turn into this specific class. And please, just friend. All right. Ah, yes, you can't come out on the uh, pounded in stake. I don't know if a void is actually helping, but I will. It's fine. They won't attack as often now. Yeah, I did. I did come right. Yeah, yeah. Or other ways. So there to we go. go. I guess it was good to go right first. There you all go. Right. Yes. Because boy, we would have walked all this way and then uh, gotten stopped. You just saved us a step. Sure did. <clears throat> the audio is like, "Hi, I'm crunchy, dude." Mm -hmm. Nice. Talk. 
Because you had mentioned it on Friday, and I don't think I noticed it at the time. So this is the only thing we could have gotten before. Mm -hmm. um, which is a good mail, but I figured... Um, Also gives luck. Oh. Use for some magical luck. Number of uses it might break if used in battle. So I guess you can also use it use in it battle. Use it to buff your luck? I mean, I would absolutely believe this was going to be one game and then it like split it. Turns it. Out I'm pretty sure Shining, can't hold it. Shining Force was basically exactly the same, if I remember rightly. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Like, it was uh, one game split into several pieces. Yup. So they definitely took the extra time when they split it to like work on this one and uh, yes let's try out we do have uh dinox who's probably nowhere near as strong as griffin <laughs> but he can attack with sharpened fangs he, he sure can go buddy go I mean, that was that as strong... Was ineffective damage still That did. was as strong as, uh, yeah, Dumba's attack. Yeah. Ineffectively, uh... I think it's just fine. <laughs> Every time we come back to this music and it goes, do, 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 <laughs> at us, I just, I just find that very funny. All right, now I pound. Now we pound in. I believe there's a pool up there that we need. Uh, parts. Suck dry, as they say. I still maintain that I think originally Alex was going to be a party member. I can certainly believe it. I mean, even if it's just like relatively early on. They gave him a normal name. <laughs> it's true. That's the real tale. I think we can parch. I cast Sock. That reveals surprise. More dungeon. Ooh, hello. <laughs> drop I never something. drop something in spring. Aging gas. Oh, she's just really <laughs> strong at the moment, huh? Yep. You're a uh, best character. Her weapon yeah, also... Alex, if he wasn't supposed to join you, then he's definitely a bait and switch. Got a normal name. Yep. Her weapon also makes it look like in the name of the moon she's gonna punish you. And, like, Pierce does kind of appear out of nowhere. Yep. He's like the only character with absolutely no connections to anything. So our reward for having parts here is a new summon. Hooray, those are always fun. Summons are the best part. All right, Ulysses, two Mercury, two Mars. So that is a four genie summon, which it means sure probably is. pretty good. We'll probably try it out in the next, uh... Yeah, what would we name, what would we name would we give Alex? That's an interesting question. I feel what? like it would probably be spoilers. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I was kind of thinking exactly, yeah, I feel like we were thinking of exactly the same person there. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And also the truncated name would be hilarious. <laughs> You're right, it would. Oh, God. <laughs> yeah, no, that would be amazing. Yes. We were allowed it fits to name him. Really well. But uh alright. So I think we just yeah. <laughs> Anyone who in chat who knows Xenoblade has probably just worked it <laughs> when he's laughing as well. Mm-hmm. Alright, so we're going all the way down here. We are going to uh This so, little strip of land. So Tundaria Tower is I believe right here. There ish, yeah. Um there is a beach here. And uh, um, we gotta go there. We're up here, so yeah. Tundar Tower is necessary. It has a piece of the trident. Uh, we'll get to uh, Genie while we're here, though, so... 
Um, I'm gonna put out a void and we are going to uh, fast forward our way down the scene. <laughs> Woo! It's like right after me. No sections. Yep. Beep, 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 beep. Ah, it's just like Final Fantasy V again. Taking breaks every so often to, uh... Re-avoid. Turns out it's a pretty long sail from Australia to Japan. And then vice versa. How I mentioned that I hate the Yalom, I have to go to this beach. I've been about twice off stream, and every time I have to come down to this damn beach down here, I sail up that river on my ship and jump off, instead of just being able to, like, to go to that go beach here, that they put right, right next to it. Those fucking monsters. I need to be on the north side. Thank god we're high enough level to, uh... Actually not fight the ocean. It's kind of wild that they expect you to kind of see this, that, like, this To beach, recognize that that is reachable, This beach right here yes. does not have... There are reefs here to stop you going over. There are reefs... Yeah, I feel like they just shouldn't have had these reefs at the south. Yeah, it... I don't know why they have them. It's really weird, like, they really do expect you to kind of just ride along the entirety of every coast and jump off at every single shoreline you can find. Because that's kind of the only explanation I can give for it. Alright. Just about there. Okay, so we declined to come here because we couldn't finish it. I don't know if it's either sand or parts or both that you need. We'll discover. Um, yeah, I wasn't gonna walk all the way. Hello, squirrel guy. Uh, I wasn't gonna walk all the way along this for one genie and then walk all the way back. God no. We've done enough sailing already. This is our third open ocean stream, isn't it? Yeah. And yeah, I will still avoid to skip it like. Oh. Out recently. Sure, would you like that close? I'm getting baked. Yeah, a little bit. Ooh, hello, lads. Um, uh, okay, what I should do is start using some, uh, genie here. Ah, yes. In preparation of blasting them. Yep. Oh, I ended up being the next guy, that was great. Mm hmm, mm hmm. Well, we will get to see the second level of our. Uh, <coughs> ah, our yes. Here. I believe we have slightly different. Like, yeah, we have Orc, Harpy, uh, Cerberus. Cerberus, and Pixie instead of Fairy. So I right, assume right. that's a less good heal. <laughs> Worse heal. Lesser um, heal. But, you know. We are now a ruffian as Dumba. Mm-hmm. Your classes just go so fucking wild in this if you ever think to use Genie. The Eastern Ocean is absolutely the biggest part of the game. You'd think it'd be Western, considering, uh... There's two continents over here we haven't set foot on. <laughs> but, like, I feel like because you have to sail um, through all the encounters, and there's there's two rocks you have to Th go through. There are, yeah, just so many zones that are surprise actually dungeons. That doesn't happen quite as much in the second part of the game. But does uh, it feel like we're more game. than halfway through the game? Because we're more than halfway through <laughs> the game. It doesn't feel that way, does it? All right. A legendary wandering mage. That's Ulysses. That's very accurate right there. Uh, so yeah, Pixie is 115. Okay. Okay. I mean, that's only slightly less. Yeah, that's not too bad, actually. Harpy. Harpy. I don't know if I'll get to see it, because I feel like uh, Dumbo might go first. And then delete. Yeah. <laughs> there. There he is. That's Ulysses. It's that. Yeah, there you go. All right, the chomps. And he just wanders away. Rip to Squirrel Fang 3. So we can just get to see some of these uh, other uh, lads. Very important. Also, stand by you because uh, think about it, if we don't, he's like really bad. That's 233 health there uh, with one Mars. 
Uh, you know, so yeah. It's his, uh... so funny how putting one genie of another color on someone ruins them. Oh yeah, it's really why like both games kind of discourage um, experimentation because. It can just fuck your snacks. There is a bit of a, like, barrier in the way that you kind of, as a kid, have to get through. Which is weird. They really should just keep you in the class that you're in and, like, you know, give you the stats. Oh, I love how the harpy spins in. Yeah, and it spins <laughs> out! <laughs> Excellent. I believe the Jin is, like, down here. Yes, it's past the uh, tower. It's like in a little dead end. Something else. I don't believe there's anything else. I don't the think there's anything here. else, no. I think that's the other thing about this huge stretch of land is it has nothing there's on it. One thing. Fork, fork, fork. Boink. <laughs> Pigmen! <laughs> it's been a bit since we've seen Pigmen. <laughs> they were in a bunch in the first game. His arm, like. We were not meant to see. His arm was just shugled, really. It was very funny. Things we were not meant to know. Do I have to go up? Yes, I think so. So I believe the tower should be here, but we passed it. There's there the it tower. is. Oh, Fiox. I know, I'm summoning you guys all the time. Yes, um... I feel, like, I feel like it's wolf, isn't it? So I guess this is just bigger wolf. Yeah, it's it's a salamander is the first one, right? Yeah. We do it, wolves are just a single target, aren't they? But I think we so. can summon wolf. Yeah, yeah. Wolves do exist. Yeah, I have no idea if Ulysses was named something different. Oh, two headed. Ah. Please get doinked. Well, what something? Yay. Savage. All right, let's. So you can see how much her stats <laughs> go up. Um, Skyrocket. By going from the second level trainer to uh, the third level beast keeper. Nearly a hundred HP. Fifty attack. Yeah, yeah, it's uh, pretty good. Yep. Summoning is always really risky in this game. Yes, that is the thing. I know I know it's why like a lot of the guides like don't bother using Jin, which is wrong. Um, but it is definitely a consideration to make. Yes, like, you, don't you can't really just dump just, all of them like, aggressively. Yes, like use your Jin and then use your summon is like super aggro-y. You kinda have to like balance. <laughs> yeah, right as right. All right, so I believe Lad should yes. be here. It doesn't really matter because if he if he runs away, you just find him again. You just do the same thing, yeah. You don't have to like reset a puzzle. I mean, the very annoying thing about the the dungeon ones is like often you have to like do a puzzle again. Yeah, leave the room and fully reset it. You are not a lad. Get out of here. I wonder if they're in there, like one of the bottom left. You don't always find them right away. No. I don't know if they're in like this Even patch, further this out. It's, it's definitely, there we there go. There he is. Down in here. Hey, buddy. All right. All up in there, as they say. Well, now that we've spread out our Venus genie, we can and Actually, I, blast. I feel like, even though it's the same <coughs> element, like mm -hmm. Griffin is going to wreckish it. So. Yeah, same hat, same hat. Oh, sh- <laughs> They cast and blast him. It's fine, don't have a recover. Don't have a recover. Watch that, dude. 166, yeah, for ineffective damage, it's pretty good. All right, it did damage. We did bigger or damage mm Mm-hmm. All right, join me. Once we get six, things are gonna get on everyone. Six is gonna get, like- <laughs> We like, get real fun. It, we're probably gonna have either a really good clown or a really good dark mage. <laughs> We haven't really had a chance to see too much of the uh, dark mage. Yeah, let's see. See her to a diviner. So the, well, the thing is, that's the two Venus, and you yeah. can see that, like, although this messes with stats, it doesn't mess with the class. So it's very minor stat downs. Like these four genie just 
don't really matter in the same way that, like, stand by one of yep. the leaders. Yes, because it is really the class much more than the genie itself that matters. You see, this changes from a privateer to a commander. Yep. Like, there's this Tonksum. Yep. Nice. Right. Cause she's actually pretty functional at this point. She's still fine with the bolt stuff. Really, it's like Jenna and Dumb are, um, Fiora and Dumb are really good right now. Yep. And these two are kind of meh. Yep. Um, because that's the other thing about like mixing and matching your genie setups. It's, it's often like... at the expense of another character. Yes. Here, Dumpstering Pierce doesn't feel the worst though, because it's not like he's amazing other than he has a heal bot. Yeah. <laughs> like. So the fact that Charles is basically now in a perfectly good class, like, kind of just means that we're about set. Yeah, she's in a tier 2 class. Um, Dumb and Fjord are in tier 3, which is why they're so good. Alvis yep. is also in a tier 2, so... Hopefully we can get everyone in a tier 3 once we get the other 6th gen, which should be in here. <laughs> So after in the East Ocean, you do actually end up with six of each. It finally balances out. Yeah. Um. It just takes, you know, uh, more than half the game. I guess the story of the game, because there's quite a bit of, like, Other. game content. <laughs> ah, so I guess so, we can yes, parch. So, yes, we can parch these. Do we want to? I believe so. Do we? The left hand one leads nowhere in particular now. So take the right one. And yeah, both games, like, because tinkering with class when you have fewer than five Jin is yeah, I have not. No idea worth if there's it. anything in that main door or not. This one? Yeah. Living armor! My god! Hey oh! Hell yes, I love these lads. They're so stout. Uh. You're out here for blood. Yeah, I am. Ha -cha -cha -cha. So it's like there are like you can put nine Jin on everyone in this. It's really once you get six on everyone that yep. things start being good. That everything is kind of at least worth something. Yep. Yeah, ah. so there we go. Finally cracked up. Ah, that is in fact the trident piece. It sure is the center one. So Sorry. yeah, you could totally walk all the way in here without parch. Uh, and the literal only thing you can do is see that there is a door here. Stare you can at the trident piece. Yeah. Cry. Oh, okay, I see. Oh, it's done I, the I keep it's having weird. to reset a void because when the fire one comes back on him. Ah, uh, yes, he like loses it. Loses it loses it, yeah. Downside of the summoning. I guess another down downside of the summoning. Stripped of his captaincy. Yep. And also broke your defense for the road. Boing. That's a little tricky. See? It's a little bit <laughs> weird, isn't it? Yeah. That was a little mean. Oh, there's Harridan. There's Harridan. Next tier is going to be slag. Get pedaled. Asian gas. 
Yeah, age that boy. Gave him the farts. Aged it so far that it's no longer a living armor. Give him the poo gas. They're at least getting some decent gold at this point. Yeah, which is good, because we'll need it. <laughs> We managed, right, spend, I think up first. Uh, we managed not to spend too much in uh, the black. Oh god, uh, in the blacksmith because we were able to sell most right, of I what we got. Don't know which one you'll want to do. Uh, which Let's way you want to go next? Once we uh, slam in, yeah, woo, 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 woo. Way. Yeah, it kind of looks like I cannot. Ah, oh, there's nothing down there. Is it down there? There's not down there. One way, baby. Oh, hey, Minotaurus. Minotaurus. <laughs> I'm Minotaurus. Sure. Kill, bro. Alright, are you ready? Uh, no, no, you're making me do the slimy I mean, eyes puzzles I hate. I'm not making you do them. Ah, uh, yeah, you are. Yeah, you do. Yes, I do. Uh, I see. Nope. There is also a treasure chest. Yes. I might be wrong, but I think if you came the other way, you would just get stuck in a corner. Which is pretty funny. Yeah, I guess I can actually get to either. So I believe that is actually just wraps around. Okay. Um, actually, and there's no items. I don't know if I can get back. Ah. Uh, yeah, yeah, you kind of have to hit that. And I'm a little trapped. Damn. Yeah, I think the chest kind of <laughs> makes you have to go all the way around again. Chest is a prank. Chest is a prank. No, I use a void, and then the game's like, <laughs> yeah, they're level like 28. No, no, Thank this you. tiny egg needs to attack you. Price to pay for numbers. Julie is nice. That's but... true. Uh, I thought we had screen transition, but actually, it was uh, Minotaurs. It was Minotaurs. Okay, so now I do that without, uh. I just go straight Shadow up roaming from yourself, here. yes. Yeah. You should do left first. Oh, three directions? Gross. Yep. <laughs> I hate it. Attempt pound. Ah, that shattered it. Okay. Ice uh, rocks can't handle a good pounding. Who can? Fair. Ah. I Let's probably see. take a look. Oh, we can ah, this yeah, there one. we go. Yep. That's a safe pounding. Yep. And yeah, man, it obliterates it. Yeah. Woo! Crystal powder. Woo! Huff that shit. I will always huff that shit. Tell me to use it on a boss at some point. Sure. Or just sell it. I mean, I just be selling it. They don't. They don't sell attack items. Don't sell for much money. Yeah. So it's not like the worst to go ahead and blast it. Yep. I mean, part of it is also that it's like we really haven't seen too many bosses. No, they're really The not. game has a bit of a dearth of bosses, despite this being one of the largest parts of it. I know, there's so few bosses. That's for sure. Enough. Let me generate, so it's fine. I 
think we want to go in the middle one now. Manticore! Oh, sorry, Magicore! Magicore! I think we fought Manticores in the first game, and they're exactly like this, but not green. We are now about at the level... We actually kind of are at the level we were at the end of yeah. uh, one. Yeah. We Which is like, so funny to think about. We were like 28 by the end of the final dungeon. Mm -hmm. Which was slightly under-leveled. Oh, no. Alright. Ah. Yeah! Dunked! 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 <gasps> Lad! Good luck. Alright, okay. I gotta be careful. Many directions I can go on. A lot of them shadow realm. Looks like this Looks left like one. Looks like up and down are both, like, yes. a square, so... Oh god, he's watching. A sliding puzzle when you can't see the whole thing seems a little mean. I I know, I was just like, I cannot see what's Yeah, I know. Down, so. At least I could reset it at any time. Yes, it's actually quite easy to get back to the starting position. And like, I don't think we get encounters on here. But I think I see what we're going to be meant to do, at least as the last few decks. I'm not totally sure how we get to the part that I'm thinking. I solve my riddle, dingus, and then fight me. I think I see it. Like I can uh, say, no. but. Really me on a tiny screen. Oh no, I cannot see what's down. Yeah, that's an issue. It hurts me. You did get it. I was like, I was looking, I was thinking, is there, is there a block to the left? Mm -hmm. Oh, I was like, just like, please be a block to the left. <laughs> It kind of has to be a block to the left, right? And certainly hope so. Yeah, I suppose the sliding ice puzzles are so much worse when you can't see them. Yup. Alright, asshole, let's go. You really have to be able to draw the path. Now, Kiev. Now, we're fighting the final boss. Yeah, this lad. This fucking old Mars gene. <laughs> he is too strong. All right, let's slam in. He is at least attacking us. No. And he's dead. All right. Potent cure. Hell so we yeah. We have finally fully. Uh... Yep. I believe this is all the gin we can get before the Muria. I believe that's the case. All the gin you can get before you kill the lemurs. Ah, counter an enemy attack. Die. Alright, shall I mess with them now then? Shall I, uh. Who do we want to make either a clown or a dark man? That's a good um, question. Make, make, uh. <clears throat> uh, Jenna a uh, dark mage. She's already a tamer. She's already a tamer and it's really good, so. She can summon chimeras and griffins for. Uh, but she doesn't get to use the Tome Gatherer card. <laughs> I'm gonna put the Tome Gatherer card on, um... Can you put it on Alvis? Yeah, sure. Let's give it a shot. Okay, so for that we have to... This is gonna end up being, uh, extremely, uh... Alright, now if we get wrong. Yeah, right. I yeah, he water, needs the right? water. Yeah, there we go. Very easy to get this it's, one correct. Yes. <laughs> no 
You can do so much with the class system, but that kind of makes it, like, very confusing. So there we go. He's now a Necrolite. 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 <laughs> Necro heavy. He knows revive, I guess. Doesn't have yeah, revive is one of its nice features. Not that avoid is much uh, help to us here. Okay, call a zombie, call a demon, raging heat, fiery abyss, fire puppet, haunt, curse, revive, down. Oh no. And... We taught Alvis how to cuss. We sure did. Yeah, a, a few of those are like those attacks that are Ooh, synergy has, that multiply. Uh, he has wish well now that she Oh, has, so we're uh, set then. Wish well, she... impact. Nice. Yeah, she's a third level. She's a scholar now. She is a scholar of the first sin. Oh, I, I was going to make an F14 check. I unfortunately do not have uh, a void. But again, it's not all that useful. Because it's yep. not working. Our only healer currently is uh, Sean. We'll see. We'll play around with this. We'll make it work. Goal. Technically, uh, Fiora is also a healer. Oh, yeah, she absolutely is. Yeah, she has, uh, only in battle, but out of battle, we have the ring, so who cares? Yep. What about, uh, Felix? Doesn't he have, like, regular cure, or was that not, Fiora? Not anymore! <laughs> not okay, currently. Dumba. Okay. Yeah, Dumba, because Dumba has, uh, all the fire, he's now, uh, no longer got healing. <laughs> And he does, however, have a fucking planet diver, which is hilarious. He sure does. I have 355 attack behind it. Oh. Alright, right door? Mm-hmm. Yeah, Necromancer or Acolyte? Necrolyte. Fire Void. Maybe we'll make a cloud or we'll get a Void back at some point. Just gonna take some time and mess around with some classes. Exactly. We're at the point of the game where we really want to. Where you can actually do it meaningfully, and not have yeah. someone stuck in, like, garbage mancer. <laughs> yeah, I think everyone is now in a tier 3, so... Yes. Now we got 6 across the board, we can at least put people in actual classes. Classes that give stat bonuses, which is important. Alright, so yeah, we've seen Prism, Hill Prism, and I've got Plasma, Shine Plasma... If anything, it's actually kind of good that Charles has access to two elements in her spells. Draw the spirit of death I to a foe. I love drawing the spirit of death to a foe. Haunt a foe with an evil spirit. Or you could just beat them up. Demon, demon, demon. Fires of the pit. And we still haven't seen what Fire Puppet does. Yeah, let's call it. I don't think we're going to get to see Call a Demon. Call it a guess, but. Fair. Especially with his slow boots. Yeah. He is, uh, kind of ludicrous, though. That's why they call him Captain Slow. I guess he actually has 120, even with the bad boots on. That is kind of uh, impressive, yeah. Class. So, like, what would he have without them? <laughs> Please, take my boots. Jesus. He would be pretty quick. Wow, actually, yeah, you know what? Uh, I'm, I'm just gonna let him be quick. Let for... him go barefoot for a brief Do we period. we have any, like, basic shoes for him? No, but there are not many boots in the game. I don't think anyone else has boots on, you see. So actually, I think Fiora I, I thought has someone had leather boots or something. Someone might have leather boots. Oh, we have gold boots. Yeah, we have the golden boots. Ah, <laughs> from... yes, boots made of gold. I actually have been bolstering his uh, agility. Mm. He's got leather uh, boots. Yeah, he has leather, leather boots. I, yeah, right, we have leather boots on everyone. And make him go barefoot. I feel like Fiora is probably one of our strongest, so I'm actually gonna give her. Make her uh, go first. Yeah. Everybody Fiora's change shoes. Is really good. Like it's a bowling alley. In the middle of a dungeon, so they're all sweaty. Hell yeah, alright. Ooh, I can move that. I'm not sure if I want to. Good luck solving my riddle, Batman. Oh, I actually. I... I, I'm gonna like screw myself as soon as I move something like away from me. <laughs> yes, I thought so. Yeah, when you move it, it uh. Also slides. It slides, yeah. Oh, 
This game actually has puzzles in the dungeons, and it's like kind of disconcerting. Yeah, like if I pounded all of those, I could, except this one, I could get the block mm -hmm. in here. And then you'd be able to pull that out. Yeah, the, like pull into it that over hole there. Here. Yeah. yeah, that's what we want to do. Not entirely sure how useful that is, but. You are allowed to do it, so it must be good. Yeah, the other bridge is just like seven at like, the end of the world, not having one. I'm sure I'll just stick nasty hyper boots. Hell yeah. You can put those turtle boots on, the worst version <laughs> of the safety boots. Here's a pair of turtle boots, and here's a second one in case you throw the first pair in the garbage. There was some consideration given where, like, there are actually fewer encounters in rooms that are puzzly. Yeah. But, yeah. It yeah, could like be more. Yeah, like Venus Lighthouse, I think, where you had to push those uh, blocks into the circuitry puzzles. I don't think there's any encounters. Mm-hmm. I say because I recently I think that did one's that. Okay. Just, yeah. yeah, if I pull it left and up, then Yeah, right. out and around. Most JRPGs aren't very good at puzzles because it's kind of hard to come up with a set when, like, you don't really have the mechanics set that Golden Sun has of, like, you yes. know, 50 different point-and-click verbs that tie into the main battle mechanic. Like, it, it's done a really good job of creating a system, of, like, creating a world where you believe that you have these weird puzzle-solving powers and everyone leaves logs just lying around. Hell yeah. Yeah, most JRPGs don't have, like, map action. Because... Yep. And sometimes they uh, do a bad job of them uh, oh. in some ways. See uh, Breath of Fire 2, where, like, oh, you need a specific party member. Good oh. luck knowing that in advance. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, Breath of Fire 2, like, uh, yeah. Like, oh, also, yeah, if you, you want to use their souped-up versions, you can go straight to hell, asshole. Also, if you don't use the monkey at all, ah, oh, fuck you, there's a point in the game where you have to, and if you haven't leveled them up, well, you're just fucked. Ah. So in the... It'd be like one top and then Ah, the existential crisis room. Well... Whoa, who thought reveal would work? In a circle? No. <laughs> yeah, so you did not use the monkey in Run the Fire 2, which you wouldn't because he sucks. Um, you you do, you do suffer. Yeah, even if like you can make him good eventually, when you get him, he's just like, why would I bother? Right? He sucks as a character and as a, like, you know, character, so. Like, Ryu and Cat are just like unstoppable. Yes. All right, we have another synergy, uh, because people don't have enough of those. All right, well, I guess Charlotte has the least shit in her inventory, so, uh... And probably the most PP. You get first, Charlotte. All right. Yeah, I gave Ivan and Shiva all of mine, basically. <laughs> That was an excellent icon. Look at that. Look at that little, little, little right side crack. Boom. Kaboom! Oh, yeah, look how violent that is. That's, uh, that's perfect. That's beautiful. I've never seen something so beautiful. Alright, so I don't think there's anything else to do. I don't know if I can, like, fall in that pit or anything. Ah. I guess let's go in this door I made for myself. Choo! Ah! Dunks is here. I'm not entirely sure why, but I guess it was well, just I think to... you could probably leave. Yeah, there is another part of the dungeon, 
but I'll probably just uh, warp out and then start. No. Yes, yeah, spin win! Oh god, it's weird seeing Alvis do anything but last. Yeah, that boy should be so slow. We have made him so much faster. <laughs> Oh, no. And faster than the wind add up, no less. Oh. Weird. That's not right. Now that's retreat. <laughs> oh, I believe we can now go in this left. Oh, we can actually now get the trident piece, right? I think we can just blow up the ice. Because Fiora couldn't just blast with a gout of flame or something. Yeah, I mean, we couldn't, couldn't fire that flame. No, you specifically need burst. We now have the center prong, so we have two bits of the trident now. <laughs> Woo! Biden. Biden. Uh, let's see what the left path has for us. That. Fired the bite end. Sure have. I do love the Raiden <laughs> Unleashed. <It's pretty> <laughs> Not all Weapon Unleashes give you an anime boy. That's, true. that's usually the Ramble Summons, although that's often an anime girl. Mm hmm. Oh god, there's a south and a north path. You poor thing. Oh, this one requires burst. Good shoe. Well, anyway, I started blasting. And we do now have two dead item slots. Mm hmm. Yes, we couldn't actually do anything on this left side without burst. Nope. Oh, we did see this. We've seen a lot of treasure, yes. Ooh, what's that thing? Oh, it's a forgeable It's a forgeable, material. which means we're going to have even less money soon. And even less inventory space for a little while. Yeah. yeah we may have quite a few dead inventory slots, but uh, the Trident uh, is one of the most egregious, I would oh, say. Oh, God, yeah. I found something that was very nice for the first game. Which was instead of having to do the damn like lottery shit, you just it just put things into the artifact section of stores. Nice. I was like, oh, that's a nice cheat. Because <laughs> yeah, like I can just sit there and save state. Yeah, I mean, I'm pretty sure that's what we did do. I believe so. How vile. Ooh, a lightning sword. Ah, it's oh, a big is, boy sword. That is quite a bit better it's than his... It's a very uh, big boy sword, huh? Than his demon mace. Uh... Alright, so I got this from the, uh... From the rusty weapon, and it's immediately outclassed. Isn't that good? Right. I think that's the thing about the rusty weapons. It's like, if you don't find or, you know, get them or whatever, you'll find another weapon that's better than it, like, basically. Yep. It is, like... Yep. You never be too far behind, yeah. So I'm gonna look at that north door, but I feel like it's just dead end. So. I believe it would just show off those treasure yeah, chests treasures, to you. but we will have a... We'll... Taunt you with them. And we're done with the tower, surprisingly, quite clearly, I Yeah, say. that worked out decently well. But now that we have burst, mm -hmm. we can finally do something that's been staring at us since, like, hour two? Keeping us down, crushing us. There was a big... <laughs> Hello. Instant. Oh, hi. There was a big, uh, rock on the boat. Uh, way, 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 way back. And, uh, we can now actually do something about that. We can burst it. Now we have three heads. Ah, ah, ah. Okay, some tar 
Victoria Tower is a lot quicker than I thought it was gonna be. Yeah. Based on every other tower in the game. <laughs> I am going to make him a punchinello. Punchinello! <laughs> because I think that should give him a void. It sure does. He's now. Alvis is now a clown. A mega clown. We got Saber Dance. Wow, we got Heat, heat Juggle. juggle we got Undercard. Undercard. We got Sweepy Card. But importantly, we have a void. So. But yes, we, we have a void. All right, we'll see what he's like as the Mega Clown. The ultimate clown, Alvis. Well, the uh, the penultimate clown. 162 agility is pretty decent. 450 health. 300 attack is like damn good. Mm -hmm. It doesn't matter which um weird class you are, the requirements are the same. It's all three genie from the uh, from your non elements. Or, uh, free non element genie. Whee! You're on the world map. So I, I know, I can't press L. I want to shortcut it. Alright, so do you think we'll make it to Lemuria today? I don't, don't, I don't right, remember I how long so. the next dungeon is. Yeah. And then there's the dungeon to get into Lemuria. Oh, but we know how that one works. Yeah. That'll be easy. Uh, no. And the boss will be easy, too. No. Easy TM. But well, we do have to go back and fix the boat and see all those scenes, and I'm sure those scenes will take a while. We yes. do have to go yes. to Champa, and then the ruins near Champa. Um, and I've got to walk all the way back across this continent, which might take five. <laughs> Especially with the encounters. I may or may not. All these needle uh, eggs. <laughs> uh, well, I guess they're needly eggs, so... Scripted. You need lay egg. But I might take my time so that you have to sail from Miria. <laughs> I see. Like, it was, I was gonna punish one of us by making us have to actually follow the kid's directions. It turns out it's you, actually. Mm -hmm. At some point we have to get... Well, since we're passing Yalom on the way, I, we might try and see what we can get with that Sils Fever. Yeah, it seems reasonable. Oh, they're such baby. <laughs> they died to everyone except Charles from a normal attack. Hell yeah. Bad. Two dinosaurs and their best friend Squirrel. Oh yeah. It's the hit movie Ice Age. Terrible bite, no. Horrible, just a shameful no, bite. Not a garbage bite. What a dog shit bite. He's death a card. death card. <laughs> All right, well we've got to play the suit of death. We, we do have to play the death card. And it is like, I might keep a clown just to have a void. <laughs> Permanent clown in the lineup. The only way we keep a void. And it's like that, or, you know, uh, Alvis gets it probably in some classes other than his base one, but... You will have to actually, like, look to see what does and doesn't have it. My boat! But, God, we want a void for streaming this game. Yeah, we do. Especially for sailing the boat. Alright, continue upwards. No, no, no. You, you don't wear off a void. Not on the boat. <laughs> Luckily, uh, I, I guess after... I think it's like right after the Muria. We don't need to worry about boat encounters anymore. I but, believe that's the case. But uh, it does necessitate getting to the Muria first. Sure does. I would love a mod for this that changes the avoid text to monsters won't attack so goddamn much now. Yeah. Gosh, I can't believe the mirror has been our only kind of pseudo goal for uh, 16 hours of gameplay. Yeah, the whole game. 
And like, even then, it's kind of just the fact that we know about it. The whole party actually wanted to go to Lemuria doesn't really happen until you get Alvis. I feel like Golden Sun 1 has, despite the two-hour start, has better pacing. Kind of, sort of. you do at least go to two lighthouses where there are Satras and Lenardi, and the Mercury lighthouse is, like, pretty early on. Like, then the, the Venus one isn't until the end of the game, but... I feel like this game, the first 15 hours, are so much busier. <laughs> yes, definitely. Alright, I don't know what we're getting out of this. We're getting something. Yes, they do give you the feathers to, like, have avoided or consumable, but, like... Terrible. I mean, you don't have many item slots. You do not want to waste That's one the big on, thing, uh, that it costs feathers. a slot. Anything you can do to avoid needing an item slot is generally good. Don't mind me, just speeding up the process of getting back. <laughs> Alright, what are we getting? How much will it cost? Got a... we got a Sylph right here. Ho ho. If that's any good. No! no. <laughs> Alas! Uh, it's real close to being, like, good, but... Percy it Mad Zephyr. Mad Zephyr! Sure does. Alright, we're gonna have this weapon shop and we're selling that. And we'll see how much gold we're down after that. This game is a little fast and loose with its uh, weapon name. Uh, basically every picture. Uh, kill that demon mace and this uh, crystal powder. I uh, guess the, the jerkin. Mm-hmm. Free up a few slots. 7-5. What rare stuff? 7-5. We are at 38,000 gold at the moment. It's a weird one, yeah. I mean, if we're not going to use them for a bit, we probably just hand them over. We're just pawning them off, you know. We'll come back. There, uh, not much in the way of slots. So. Dehumanize yourself and face to slow Alvis. I'm sure we'll see more Sylph Feather, so we can uh, do more saves coming yep. stuff later, potentially. Honestly, like, we're kind of good enough that the armor probably make, doesn't make any difference. Doesn't matter too much, yeah. And we've got the only good ring, so. Alright, I have no idea what the easiest way to the boat is, Valhafra. Yeah, unfortunately it's, it's probably just beach. that, yeah. yeah. Just to give you a little bit extra. It's about all that healing, avoid is the top uh, synergy. Mm hmm. Put the boat in turbo mode. Yep. So if I don't want to be the one during the Muri, I really should. <laughs> I I reckon Put this the boat in plus Chaka plus the ruins we have to do will take us yeah. just before the Muri. Oh, and honestly, if we only go two hours, like like if we do that quickly and it ends up being around two hours, we can just end up there. Let me a in. Stopping point. Let me in. I want to fix Literally your boat. Literally right there. I want to fix your boat. Yeah, what good's your boat gonna do you? It's gonna just be in a little pond. I'm not really sure why that's reefed off right? either. Makes, it does not make sense. A lot of the weird reefing in this game is just kind of make to waste your time. Yeah, it's like I guess technically back there is like part of the town, but it is like dumb. So there is more to that cave once we. Uh, free the boat as mm -hmm, well, right? Mm -hmm. The passageway to the left. I we came back here with frost and it wasn't good enough, so. Yeah, I don't quite remember everything. But... I, I think we do need to free the boat. Mm -hmm. all Luckily, right. all of the stuff that we've already done on the boat is done, so we just yes. have to get to that stupid fucking rock. Right, we have to pipe down. I feel like this is the long way around, isn't it? It is, yes. Made like a shortcut over here somewhere. We did. I think it's on like the top left mast. Yeah, there's a rope there. Yeah, and you can jump up. It does not really No, look like that looks like a background that. element, and that's a long ass jump because it's the the mast is so thin there. 
And the this side of the boat. The tiling kind of fails at that point. All right. So you anyway, we finally start blasting. Need to blast. Well, burst, I guess. Burst. Blasting. It. Burst. It. So violent. Very satisfying watching that. Now. All right, boat fixed. So now we're gonna need two weeks to like reattach the mast. Ah, uh, that takes like five minutes. It is minutes. still broken. Ah, uh, we fixed your boat. Boat fixed. Boat Fifth fixed, boat fixed. There we go. I was just coming here to do my daily boat watching. Yes, yeah, so you need to do Aqua Rock before you can do Tundaria Tower. Yep. Technically, I guess you could do this before Gaia Rock. I think it's yes, sad. I believe Gaia Rock is separate. Oh, hey! Baba Booey! It's, it's Baby! We finally have located Baby. That's Olio! Riolio! Riolio! My good friend, Riolio. The block is gone. That's a child right there. Uh, yes, I did it. I knew you'd do it someday. It just took like 14 hours. <laughs> it took yes. a while. Rex is in jail. What's he gonna do? Puppy shoe. Oh no, he has a baby that can uh use he can't talk but can walk and use synergy, so you know. It, I mean, it, it's true, he didn't see it technically. Mm -hmm. It is gone. Fair enough. Yup, that's still a boat. What? Arr? Whoa, hey. Whoa, hey. Hey. Whoa, hey. Guess some idiot came along and bursted it. Why is it called burst instead of blast when I, it's a bomb? I don't know. I keep thinking it's called blast, but it is called burst. <laughs> For last. For last. Me, I moved it. Boomst is our strongest compatriot. Hi, it was me, again. Hello. I, I... It was me, the guy who fixes all your problems. I take all the credit for doing everything, ever. And bad news, that means cutscenes. Oh, hey, Kraden. Yeah, this is the reason why I'm like, maybe I probably won't make it to the movie. <laughs> because we've got, like... we got some chatting to we've do. We've got cutscenes here. We've got cutscenes in Champa. You know, we've got, uh, we've got cutscenes to get through. I didn't have any kind of a hunch. I knew there was a rock that I needed to blow up. We did see the rock. Yes, make the townspeople fix the mast at once, and then definitely nothing Noth is going to happen to this nothing ship. Nothing will happen to this boat. Absolutely. Those pirates that are in the, the jail, don't worry about it. It's fine. You wish to come back to the manor? Uh, sure, why not? I can rest at the manor while some well, pirates break out Nothing jail. bad is going to happen. Nothing bad would ever happen. We keep a fine house. It's just this room. Yeah, don't worry about it. No. I don't think he has to worry about that, though. He's way too nice. I'm suspicious. I heard that. Something you'd like to share with the class? No, stop talking shit. Uh, why are we all gone sepia town? Time is passing. We're about to get ghost tricked. beds in your house. You invited me over, but there's nowhere to sit. How have the repairs been going? How long have we been here? You're right, there is a blast synergy, of course. Combat synergy. So I needed to name it something other than blast. Yep. Is that good? <laughs> I like to imagine Briggs just punched the walls open. Because <laughs> they were made of, like, really shitty concrete or something. Oh, yeah. Ooh, this is some exciting music. 
Oh, it's one of the strongest in Oceana. It's one of the only one ones one in Oceana. <laughs> it smashed a hole in the wall. I wonder if they used that newfangled synergy. Oh, it's a good thing the mass has been raised just in time for someone to steal the ship. Why is Jenna's battle theme playing here? I don't quest I don't I don't care. It's a great theme. Because we're excited. It's a fucking awesome theme. It's at the least. first time anything exciting has ever happened in Golden Sun. Briggs has. And we left the keys in the ignition. Battle. Famous pirate, you say? Heard enough of that. Get the fuck out of here. Get the fuck out of here. Get the fuck out of here. You didn't expect my boat. Are we? We didn't steal your boat. What, what are you accusing me of? What? I think he wants us to go beat up the pirates again. You let us stay in your home because we fixed your boat. You were returning the favor to us. You don't then get to claim a favor on that, my dear. This was the pro, not the quid. Right, exactly. This what? guy's like the biggest jack, greedy jackass. He sure is. <laughs> and I was just like, no, that guy's a jerk. He said a, a politer way than I did. <laughs> and she wanted to say it how I did. <laughs> Do we go after Briggs? Eh, why not? Yeah. I got nothing better to be doing. Why not? I mean, I'm not doing him any favors. I feel like talking to Briggs might end up getting me shit. I want to go high five him. I get, I might get items. You know, uh, his grandmother's waiting for him in Chop, but maybe she'll give us something. It is true. We very technically helped him escape by fixing the boat. Incidentally, uh, it's kind of funny how you just, if you don't remember the name Briggs or like just happen to go into that door in Champa, you might have no idea like that she's his grandmother and that like the whole forging thing on the trident is requires you to free Briggs. Of course because the grandmother won't come out and use that yep. forge because you don't go to Yellow to forge you go to Champa, right? I forgot about that. Yup. Yeah, the grandma is the mega for is the mega smith. So we'll go to the ruins first, because that's where the last bit of the trident is, and then Briggs, go, and my then boat. go to Champa, right? Yep. Attempting to steal it? I think he's already stolen it. Yeah, he's I, that is successfully that, stealing. That yes. is absolutely successfully stolen. Are you you are a thief, buddy. Like And you are a thief though. I mean just own it. My dude, like, be like, I'm no thief. It's like, but you stole all that money you used to pay for the boat. Stolen money. Like, you're not wrong, though. I mean, everyone There was not money rendered for goods and the services. The mayor is a thief, yes, 100%, but you are also thieves. Let's not get weird here. The boat you acquired through stolen goods. Hey, Briggs, says Kraden. Hello. It's me. I'll beat you yeah, up. Yeah, but again. I can't swim out here. You should absolutely be afraid of me. We're I'm, even higher hey, level. Hey, I met your grab. I'm going to rat you out, buddy. I'm going to go to her and tell her that you're a piece of shit. You've been poiridin. But you've been I'm going to have great your ass. It's the best way to, uh... To get someone is to tell their nan <laughs> what they've been up to. That's true. Also, we have a boat, and we know where you're going. Wasn't there something you wanted to do? Do you want to taunt us for some reason? Because, like, I will kick your ass again, buddy. I know where you live. I know your nan. <laughs> <laughs> it's even worse than knowing where you live. I know, knowing right? where your nan lives. Oh yeah, she's gonna kick your ass, yeah. buddy. Oh man, his grab is going to destroy him. Not even gonna flip the bird. Wow, wife is just stirring shit right here. Wife is the mega thief, huh? Husband, you should taunt these people with immense psychic powers. <laughs> what? I'm not gonna keep all half for safe. I don't care. They have sailed like a nautical mile in the time that this conversation has been going on. Yeah, buddy. Neener, I... neener, bleh. 
My wife's impressed by that for some reason. I mean, I'm absolutely gonna chase you back to Champa. Thank you for telling me where I already knew you were going. Whee! It's fine. It's gonna take make them take a really long time to get Mayor, up there. Mayor, why are you mad? You still got all that shit they stole unless, I don't know, Madra took it back. I mean, we were in your house. Whatever. They bought it. They did buy it. I mean, it. I will. they bought it with stolen goods, but they did, in fact, give you money for a boat. <laughs> Knock that old man into the water. What exactly does it ruin, dude? Your boat was fucked anyway. Pick him in the river. I'm going back to my manor. You people disgust me. What? What? I don't care. Fuck off. I don't know if we ever get to it. Aww. But you know what? I'm gonna go take my uh, money from breaks. you get any comeuppance, Mr. Mayor? I don't remember if he ever shows up again. We have no boat, so therefore we have no port. Now craden has got to get his line in. Oh, we can absolutely use room to push someone in the ocean. Yeah, you know what? I'm going to agree with you on this one, Kraden. I know we're telling you terrible things, but uh, I, got, I have to agree with him on that one. That mayor's yeah. a dick. Oh, really? He did yell about it. I uh, nah, let's not leave. I actually have a thing to do first. I believe if we go to his cell, it will also have an item in it. Excellent. I don't know where his cell where is. where the cell was, yeah. But, there, it does have items. Where was the jail? Church. That might be a jail. That seems. Is this jail? That seems that was, like a jail. That was jail. Jail, but spelled G A O L. Oh, you, uh. You guys really underestimated the wife. Uh, um. I wonder if it's actually in the other cave bit. Get in. Yeah, we come in the, uh. Um, I'm actually not entirely sure how this works, but... Me neither. I'm pretty sure we should be able to harass them. Mm-hmm. Are there encounters in here? I feel like there were. Ah, yes, there are now footsteps. They, uh, broke whatever was in the way. Yep. Oh, we don't have frost. Ah! Oh no, uh, hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Alright, uh. Yeah, that's the problem of making him a clown. I know! I don't think, like, unclowning him will be, uh. You can probably just rip off every, uh, gin if needed. Yeah, I'm gonna have to. <laughs> Whoops! Turn off the thing and then stand by all his gin. Yep, that'll do it. Can't believe they tried to get the treasure and failed. I feel like it really shouldn't. Um, take away those ones? Yeah, take away the map action ones. Yep. But even if it just leaves you with the lowest level, you know, like Frost, that's it. That'd be fun. Yeah, it's the fact that, that, like, you have both attacking and map action ones, and there's, like, very few of those in the game, but whenever there are, it's like, oh, come on. And then there's Grow, which it never gives you an item for, despite expecting you to use. Yup. And then it also, also demonstrates actually that go down from here. they oh, programmed a way for people... Uh, that's fair. 
And they clearly programmed a way for people to, like, just always have certain synergies. Yes. Yes. It's totally and just possible. learn them instead of needing an item. But then they don't use that. Yep. Bread. We discovered bread. The hoomst. Bread for the hoomst. Yes, max of HP. Uh, probably Charles, who has, like, none. Charles, who always dies. Alright, can I escape this direction? No? Fair enough. Alright, can I just retreat? No, it doesn't work here. Fuck. Alright. I have to walk out. Alrighty, uh, I think that's everything in this town, so... Now, uh, yeah, there's one more ruins the last... Uh, bit of trident, which is right near Champa, which of course we have to go to right, go to the ruins first because we need all the trident bits for most of the stuff. Right, I no longer have a board. I can just like use a button to do that. Right. I kind of always forget there's a one button. <laughs> Be the clown again. Be the clown we always wanted you to be. Because I think we can go to the ruins first. Yes, yeah, so we'll go to the ruins first because no point going to Champa without the uh, last bit of the tribe. It's a long walk through Champa. I'm just. Yeah, it's like one of the bigger towns just in terms of pure area in the entire game. Ruins, I think, are up here. Yes, I believe so. I believe we need sand in order to do this. So. Maybe this is the tower. Surrounded by uh, a mountain and a little bit of uh, beach. You look down it from like this direction. Yeah, maybe. Potentially. I feel like it's like pink though, so I think mm -hmm. it might be. I feel like it might be. It looks more like a tower tower than these ruins. Sure. Oh no, I need whirlwind. <laughs> wah wah. Wah wah. How do I need? This is the other thing that is like really encouraging yes. um, experimentation. It's it's really messed up. Both frost and whirlwind are like kind of problematic. Okay, I'm gonna put everyone back to the post. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. The great evening. It also just takes a bit to uh, actually perform all these actions. Yep. Goodbye to my lucky card. That way, should keep a void. Yep. Alright, everyone now has 6 GP. If 
be very funny if we did all that and there was nothing behind that. <laughs> There's another one over here as well, which... It's actually a path in the middle. I suppose if you have the stuff to make someone a ninja, they can use Whirlwind as well. Yeah, I have no idea. Probably, but I'd have to look it up. Yeah, I, th I think if you give uh, Dunbo like three fire and three wind, that'll make him a ninja. Make some other people weird stuff. Uh, yes. I will leave that for now. All right, which path do I want to go? Middle, oh, right, Jesus. or left? Enter the ruins, ignore overgrown doors, they don't hold anything, and locate the chamber with the huge stone faces. What? All, all the doors were... Those look this, like faces. This is the stone faces, yeah. Alright. Gosh, there are a lot of directions. Oh, is this through a stone face or this left and right? You also, I think... Probably. I'm like so confused about this map. I would not follow you for this one. I mean, I, the... I know you prefer to. No, no, I just mean I don't know what any of this means either. The middle one is its centerpiece for including the player into removing the Oh, statues. yeah, so you can, like, uh, I assume it's removed. Okay. Okay, like, a bunch of these have items behind them? Yeah. Does it say which ones? No. Alright. I so potentially, potentially see Ninja at some point, but on the fly, uh, trying to find a Whirlwind. Trying to get classes for everyone. <laughs> yes. Earn 10 coins. I think it goes southwest after that. I think it's the far right one. Synergy. Mm hmm. Yeah, I think it is the far right one. None of the other ones have anything. Well, there was uh, 210. Um, uh, sorry, of the two. I like another one. Yeah. You just can't get rid of them. Nice. Yes, I think it's the left one that we want to go to. Yep, left. I go north or south. Oh, I'm gonna do it. I guess none of these have anything. Doesn't seem like it. Oh, yeah, okay, so I think the exit that we want to go to is, yeah, these stairs here. Now I see where they are. Alright, up and around. Sad, sad, sad. And then time for some digging. There's just so much different synergy in this. I know. I can't, like, shortcut any of it. Nope. Yeah, yeah! So I remember this. Oh, that's cursed. <laughs> that has to be cursed. What? The Thanatos curse? <laughs> no! I don't even know if it's any, like, better than anything. Yeah, it's not, it's even, not even any good. Yeah, it's not even as good as the shit. Oops, ass. our weapons are too good. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Alright, so I don't think we have to go up. Go back somewhere. I think so. Oh, wait. Uh, no, wait. Go north. Go. Get to push a thing. 
Yep, yep. I want to take his face on. It's not how it goes. Pretty sure that's what he said. That's mm, not how it goes. <laughs> Stand. Stand. Just had to make him barf. Yeah, sure did have to make him barf. Alright, so now we're going back to the other floor and whirlwinding one of the other ones on the uh, higher bit. Guess what? It's sand time. Yeah! At least they made, like, getting to the menu really easy, but it is definitely, mm -hmm, like, mm -hmm. when you have this many synergies to do, it's like, oh, God. But yeah, you have to, um, like, each trident part requires you to... Uh, further... I mean, we can't jump over that, but yeah, this, this is where we're going. Keep going, and then we'll hang a left, uh, roll in some of these other ones. I assume it's the middle one. Yeah, every every trident piece requires one uh, a synergy from one of the rocks. Yes. So the first one we got re like required reveal. Uh, the second one, Tundaria Tower, required uh, parch, and this one requires sand. Yep. A chest here, and then we dig in. Yes, more power bread. Some more, uh, more HP. Mm -hmm. As long as she survives a boss hit, we're basically good. Mm -hmm. It will have paid off. Yep. I do love delicious ancient sandy bread. Mm -hmm. That's my favorite kind of bread. I think the other path has treasure. Great. Right. Goodbye, Harden. <laughs> ah, can't get through that one. Ah. Come down here, though. That's how's it going. Yeah, she does have a uh, healing aura in this one. All right, cycle team. Diamond, Diamond Berg. Diamond Berg, hell yeah. Silas is back to being really slow again. Yes. In his normal class, he is slow as molasses. Mm hmm. That's why the safety boots work for him in that. He is old, so. That was a long pass for a. That. 365 coins. I was really worried there was going to be a door there. Yeah, you see, he's Garrett, but even worse, actually, because at least Garrett can rock. Pierce doesn't even hit as hard as uh, Felix. Nope. No. Back all the way back around. Yup. I think here there should be some switches for sand. Not gonna diamond burg anyone. Alas. A little slow, however I get it on is probably dead before you even get there. Fair. Oh, I guess that Minotaur lives. Yes, yes. Burned. Ha cha 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 cha. Oh, 200 uh, damage is pretty respectable. Mm hmm. I think left is where that treasure was, which... Oh boy. So it's a vial. Yeah. I guess it's up to you if you care enough. Yeah. Because you'll have to go around back. It's, it's a treasure. Fair enough. Oh, I see. Yeah. 
Yeah, go get that vial. Got it. Go Games is mean. Gotta get a vial. Play the sand. Mm -hmm. Is there a boss at the end of this dungeon? Question. No. I don't believe so. But there is one in Champa. Yes. Think. When we actually go do the plot at Champa, there will finally be a boss for the first time ever. This entire game. It means there won't be a boss this game unless we get through the spruins in like 15 mm -hmm. minutes. <laughs> Two bosses next stream. Whoa! Whoa! -ho. It, it is very weird to have all these big long dungeons without boss and fights. No at bosses, the end of them. like in any of them, yeah. I feel like Golden Sun One had boss fights in pretty much every dungeon like in, that wasn't just like a tunnel. Yeah, like in terms of boss fights, we basically had the uh, serpent Rochi. That's like about it. I see. All right. I think you have to hit that switch before he covers it. Yeah, before it. he blows again. <laughs> so it's a weird puzzle. Mm -hmm. Like that's it. Well, I guess we're just uh, pull, we're just pull, pull, slamming pull. down in the hole. Oh, I see. That lets us back. And allows us to, get to, to continue to put his face on. And there, there's another bit of face we have to have to put together. This dungeon's gonna be longer than the tower. Mm-hmm. The whole, all the dungeon pacing is just so strange in this. We're going the like north. Yeah, yeah, I just wanted to like check. Yeah, you know, I'll have to like go down here for the end. Might actually be down and around. So it's kind of all the way east. Rather than that north. Okay. I think we can push a stump here. Oh, no. Oh, no, we're blocked. Uh, the guide is leaving out large portions of this, which means that every time I read a sentence, I have to figure out how much intervening. Why did we fall there? <laughs> what the fuck? That doorway has a really big step in it. First door. Ah, you put that stone. You love to push a stump. That's a doorway right there. Mm-hmm. Ah, <laughs> uh, just here to taunt us. Taunting me. Wants to go back to the face chamber at the start. We've allegedly gotten a uh, shortcut back to that. Okay. Not totally sure where though. Okay, it's just those. Hmm. I I don't think I can. No. The other thing about the directions is they, of course, refer to the map, so lost track of that. It's... I don't think you can move diagonally from. Uh huh. Not that one. Um. Really anywhere to go, but. Here. Yeah, I guess so. We might as well just follow it along. And maybe this will take us somewhere. Hooray, sand. You love sand. Oh. Ah, there we oh, go. Oh yeah, this is the start. All right. This is faces. All right, exit southeast, which we have not gone down yet. Yep. <coughs> it can be hard to keep track. Oh yeah. 
At least the enemies are kind of staying away from the part. Yes. And there's one item along this path and their way. After we get to the stairway. Okay. Fuck your leaves and your leaves yeah. and your leaves. Yeah, fuck them up. What do I need this uh, PP for? Mm -hmm. Nothing. There's no boss. I don't need to save PP. Exactly. I just do what I want with it. Finally ride the Muni. Where's HP? And is better than our current stuff. I'm gonna give up Festival Coat. Alas, goodbye, my beautiful Technicolor Coat. Huh? <coughs> oh, no door on this one. And it takes so long to learn that. Oh my god. You learn it basically right away, and it's like, yep, keep, uh, keep checking those leaves. Mm-hmm. So many of them. Oh, that's an interesting little sand pile, huh? Very sneaky. But... Really? There's, like, nothing... I'm actually nothing... not sure if there's... there is, yeah. There's nothing here? You just did a sand. Well, I feel ripped off. <laughs> we want to go to the left here and then left again. Yeah, we can't really. Yeah, yeah, up that stairway. Well, this place is. Hmm. Ah, so that's the log we pushed out of the way. So I think we want to push that one down there. I don't think I could. Oh, you're right. Yeah. Weird. Yeah, good thing we did that. Yeah, or we would have gotten yeah, stuck oh right here. Oh god, you'd have to go all the way around. You'd be yep. pranked very hard. So pranked. That's a doorway. It looks like a doorway right there. Mm -hmm. Continue it on. So I'll go yes. in the doorway yes. first. That should have a treasure in it. Yeah, ah, treasure. it's that treasure that we Hello. stared at longingly. Another sylph feather. So yeah, at some point we'll be uh, we'll be heading back to Yellow and trying to get something good out of that. God help us. Not the rapier, which I uh, already used. Mm -hmm. All right, it's another sand quote unquote Take two. puzzle. Oh god, oh, made it just. Wow. We have a shit that avoids effect wore off. I'm sanding here. Blech. I don't know if that's as high as it goes or if it. This is a good question. That's a doorway. This is more. Yeah, this is more Gaia Rock than Gaia Rock. I yeah, must really. Say. Guy Rock had like growth. That was really kind of it, right? A move? Yeah, move is like sort of weirdly an earth synergy in this. Even though it's really a hand synergy. Now this being a uh, sand feels a lot more actually like earthy. Yup. There aren't really any specifically earthy ones, except I guess Tremor, which we only ever use for like rando items. Oh, very rare occasion. Like, it's almost never required. Push that face. I would never push a face. What? No, that's... I... Guess he's... No, he's... He's just angry. Let's go back and have a chat with him. Huh, hello. You're not gonna bleh, stand at me? Nope. He hasn't even eaten today. 
That's true. Hard to vomit when you haven't eaten. Not impossible, but hard. You haven't eaten 500 tons of sand. That too. Gosh, this is a dungeon of wasting your time. It really is. Wow, I forgot about this one. Same. I mean, I kind of forgot, like, you know, the specifics of pretty much all the Trident dungeons. I, like, always remember, uh, Air's Rock. Yes. There is nothing but Air's Rock. Armor. Finally, a strong enough fight. Well, actually, I have to avoid my comps so ah, I can see what the fights were. Right, right. It's like, we managed to like, not get into any fights, so I guess everything here is level 27. I, I guess like so, yeah. We now. How weird. Yep. And we are now uh, at endgame one levels. Yep. We have accomplished nothing, which is similar to one. Oh man, yeah, we have we have super accomplished nothing in this game. All right, heads, you want to yell at me? Whoa, whoa, whoa. He wants to befriend you. He wants to give you a hug, but he has no arms. Good thing he doesn't keep pushing you when you uh. Are in the pause menu. That's what the patch of sand was for. There, there you, you go. go. You now know. I'm glad we don't have to grow any of these vines that would have. Although we actually do have, uh, not currently, but we, like, we did have grow. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. do seem to be ascending, so I think we're potentially almost done. We're, here. we're getting there. Yes, I believe we are almost done with this place. We're being judged in the oh, background. Probably will go chop and do that boss fight there. There we go. Finally fucking... Shove this one out of the way after 300 years. Ah, uh, hi. Hey, look. Yon Ho. Oh, went to the edge. Wow. <laughs> Made the edge a little too far. I, I always thought the whole of reveal was a little annoying. <laughs> or the, uh, the viewport. Yeah, and if you strain right to the end of it. Just a bit tight. Yeah. It's really weird how reveal actually changes the state of a thing. Yes, you can't like push you, in there. Yeah. It's not like it's fake until yeah. you reveal it. Yes. It's one of those things about reveal that is so strange. Like if you reveal a hole in the wall, that hole in the wall is just not there unless you feel on it. it. You will just hit a wall. Yep, it's just a wall. Which is different from a lot of games, where it's like, they kind of just use the knowledge to get you, whereas here, the, the gate is actually reveal. Alright. We um, gotta get back there. Well, I guess we use the shortcut we made. Yes. It's like, been so long, I've already forgotten where this is gonna put us. Yeah, this puts us out here. This place is a maze. Yeah. Hey. Hello. Hello. I, I am alive. Hello. <laughs> Congratulations. Uh, sorry about the hood of your uh, cooker. <laughs> yeah. It's <laughs> a good way to put it. I, I thankfully I, I put it back together and it's working just fine. It's like there was no damage aside from a little bit of drywall mm -hmm. uh, falling out. Mm -hmm. That's good. Um, and it's working, and that's no problem. My only problem was, uh... It spooked the shit out of me. I, yeah. <laughs> is what happened. Things going for your head will tend to do that. Mm. It's so weird how slowly you go up that, like, sand fall, but when you stop, you just stay stopped. It's really weird. It's not actually fighting against no, you, no. It's really weird. So, hey, we're about to get our final trident prong. Woo! About to graduate oh, from Bident to trident. We did Tundaria Tower already. Nice. Yes. Yes. Uh, you did miss. We did mess around with classes. We had uh, Jenna as the East Trainer, the like third level of the Tamer, and we had uh, Alvis as Mega Clown. Uh, nice. But when we came in this dungeon, I needed Whirlwind, so we had to like 
everyone back. You just swapped everyone normal. back. Makes yeah. sense. Yeah. The one big problem. Uh, that you I lose think. These map ones. Yeah. So the funny thing is that uh, there is a, a subtractor to this game where you get Jin very very quickly and in a very weird order. And then once you get to this part of the game, roughly, and like moving on a little bit, the the rate of Jin drastically slows down. Oh yeah. And and then after that, it um, it speeds up again after uh, you you get the uh, the forty five members from one back. Yep. Because they basically kind of expect you to have uh, close to or equal numbers to what they had when they end the game when yep. you get them. And the way that they place them is slightly awkward. Wow, that yeah. that took some doing. <laughs> that took like three attempts. <laughs> and a frog. Uh, I'm, I'm kind of I'm a little sad that I missed Sundaria Tower, which is my own fault, so don't worry about that. Um, but because uh, I distinctly remember, even though it's been a long time since I listened to it, Tandaria Tower has one of the best tracks in this game for the music. It was pretty good. Yeah. All right, I think we're done here now. I think I have to go in to retreat. I don't think it lets you retreat from the Foxer Towers. You're outdoors. Why would you want to retreat? Yes, we also freed Briggs, so he is now in Champa. Ah, uh, right. Uh, so you also did Magma Rock. Right. Uh, no, Tendara Tower has burst, which will eat. Uh, oh! Oh, right, yeah. Oh, whoops. I forgot about Yeah, okay. Yep. So a part of my my mind, Ooh. I I could have swore burst was actually the thing you get off of Magma Rock, but no, I, now that you... Yeah, that makes sense now, actually. It's double weird, though, because why would Tundaria Tower have the blow <laughs> the of the spell? <laughs> yeah. I, I remembered needing to, uh, Burst in Tundaria Tower, which is why I thought, oh, you have to yes. do all the rocks yes. first. You do need it in Tundaria Tower, but you get it from Tundaria Tower. Yeah. Right. There's a whole that, section. That is a, so far, I think, the only, like, glaring error in my remembrance of how the game's progression works. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. He brought what? you a lot of stolen jewels and food, and we're about to go clip on him to his nan, and she's gonna, you know, put a flea in his ear. <laughs> As one does. Yeah, I know where you live, idiots. <laughs> Rico Briggs is like, nee, 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 and it's like, well, I know where you live. I think no, where your grandma lives. He, he just assumed he didn't have a boat for whatever reason. <laughs> yeah, it's right? a little weird. I guess he's been in jail for a long time. Can I run? It is very funny. He's like, oh yeah, those guys can't swim. And I'm like, I have a boat. I used a boat in order to free your boat. <laughs> I needed a boat to free you. <laughs> Idiot. You better be shaken. Time to mind read some, uh... Time for spooky Charles. I mean, I don't need your boat! I have a boat! It, we could only get here if we had a boat. That's kind of the point. <laughs> <laughs> I guess they're like, do you want to take the boat back to that mayor? And it's like, nah, I hate the mayor. Oh, he, fuck that guy. He, he's an asshole. <laughs> like, what a jerk. Ow, oh, I ain't doing him a favor. All right, Briggs, where's your granny? I have to... <laughs> Sissy boy. <laughs> uh, okay. There we go. Uh, no, I haven't actually, but... I I'm actually here to see Briggs' grandmother because I've heard she's a really good blacksmith, but I feel like I'm in need of that for some reason. Well, we've got a whole bunch of prongs. And we need to make a full prong goal. And we can't we can't just, you know, take it to a regular blacksmith who we already know. We need her. Uh, I think this the is the forge. forge, yes. Yeah. Oh, hello. And we did we did be a Briggs quite a few levels ago, so we're even more monstrous now. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, we're gonna... Oh, hello. oh, we were supposed to come here. Okay. Oh, yeah, there's, there's, there's Grad. <laughs> she was just right. off screen. Are we gonna have to beat up your granny? Oh, I'm a pretty mighty warrior, all right.
No. Nope. Gonna get a boss fight? Yeah, I'm not interested in your jewels. Hey, hey, Grant, can you make me a trident? Unless these jewels grant some sort of uh, puzzle solving power. Oh, yeah, do you have, like, any kind of synergy jewels? We'll steal those happily. Bring me puzzle jewels. Rex, I'm not gonna take you in jail. I really don't care. <laughs> <laughs> he looks so nice. Even his grand's like, oh, but he looks like a lovely boy. Come on, son. Uh, preying up uh, on the gram, uh, you know. I actually think that she's, like, his great-grandmother, actually. And that means yeah. that Yoli is, like... She's, wow. like, Yolio's great-great-grandmother. There we go. Oh, my God, yeah, there we <laughs> yep. go. Or is it great-grandson because that's the Yolio? The yeah, I guess, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, Yolio's the great-grandson. Okay. Her I, grandson's I, a fuck-up, but Yolio... He's not a fuck-up Still up the hope. Yet. He's, he's two years old. It's hard for him to be a fucker. Exactly. Well, there is Dark Dawn, so like, maybe Doc is the only old fuck up in Dark Dawn. Haven't played it. Uh, Eolio's like barely a character in Dark Dawn. Like, he's a playable character, but I think he gets like, aside from all of the constant. Oh yes, I am a party member. I chime in on this idea as well. Um, I think he's pretty much just a. He has like a couple of lines and that's it. So <laughs> Alvis levels. We're gonna fight this granny. Oh yeah. hell yeah. <laughs> uh yeah. worse than Alvis. Alvis at least has a little bit of a character arc of having to not character oh. arc, but like a character relevance in, hey. uh, in the plot. Boy. By being the The boat. Actually, now that you say it, they both have the same amount of relevance because they both have the boat. That's right. No, <laughs> the <not>. Boat <laughs> owner, got it. Boat owner. Yeah, boat they're owner. just boat owner. <laughs> My ultimate aspiration to own a boat. So that I can purchase friends. <laughs> yes. So, I, if I remember right, Avamander is like, um, it's not that bad. Like, it's a, it's a reasonable fight, uh, but if you, it has like one big attack on it that can be uh, a big nasty. At the same time, though, I, I don't think it really matters all that much, especially if you just uh, stun it. Not with all of these genies, especially. It does look like it gets two, uh, two moves a turn because it was stunned twice. Every boss does that now, basically. Yeah, yeah every boss is two. Uh, unless it's a, a fight with multiple enemies, yes. every boss in this point on attacks uh, twice or more. I'm back. So... Uh, that actually reminds me. Uh, in Dark Dawn, Dark Dawn's combat is comically easy 99% of the time. It has, mm -hmm. like, that's another part of why that, like, that game is not that great, because, like, it's on top of increasing the mechanical complexity while also reducing the snappiness of the, uh, of the, the fights in that game. Right. Um, it kind of fails to even really actually have you engage with that by making all the fights super, super easy. Everything just uh, Up until the final boss. Because, like, uh, at the very end of the game, where uh, almost everything in the game was like, okay, it only hits attacks once, even in boss fights and shit. Um, suddenly, the final boss is like, it, oh, yeah, it swings three times. It has a whole bunch of things that, like, uh, wow. it, it has, like, all of the, the, the cheap-ass things that uh, notably hard fights in these games do. Yeah. And it's like... It stands out as being way harder than the, almost the entire rest of the game. Yeah, where was it's kind this? of funny. Now, I don't know how much earlier you can do Avimander, because you do have to do... Aqua. I guess if you... I mean, if you don't do... It'd be not doing Gaia Rock and then the Ruins we yeah, did. Basically. Those are the two dungeons you can skip. And then, like, the, uh... There's Rock stuff, or the reveal for the, uh, Trident. Yeah. Other yeah, piece. The, the absolute... The absolute minimum, I think, is just you have to beat um, Tandaria Tower. And yeah. you can do that relatively early in your open world exploration part if you want. I'm what do you even do, Alice? Anymore. <laughs> <laughs> It, it was... deciding, okay, everyone else has already gotten their move and what they're doing. Alvis, what do you even do? 
Chris, what do you do I here? I can't solve this problem with my boat. I don't. <laughs> It was very funny when we made him. We made, actually made him the third level of Dark Mage um, and the Clown to try them out. And he actually had agility, and we were like, what the heck? He was like going like second. Like, how this? Yeah. What the fuck, man? The Dark, the dark Mage class line is actually just really good yeah. across the board. If I remember right, the only issue with it is that all of its moves are very, very pee pee hungry. Yes, they're quite expensive. I'm trying to remember what I have because we've been swapping so aggressively. I know. What do I? What do I even have right now for like healing? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Who's does the heals? Finding it might not be the worst. Yeah. I, I think up. mechanically, there's a thing about breath where I I think it always goes first. I think it has, like, priority to always go first. It does something. say quickly, doesn't it? Yeah. Yeah. I do love when it's quickly. I love how there's all that stuff you sort of just have to know about. <laughs> yeah. Ouch. Yeah, he's starting to be mean, but he's slower than Janna, so... When we use Breath Cures a target party member with 40% of its maximum HP, this effect has the Strikes First property that guarantees it to go occur as the first action of a given turn, yep. regardless of the user's agility, unless another move with the Strikes First property is used in the same turn, in which case agility will be measured. Oh. Help me, Molly. Oh, sleep. Yeah! I might wake him up, I actually don't know how sleep works. <laughs> I feel like it's weird. But like regular physical attacks will do it, but not much else will. I could even be wrong about Oh, he died. I like summoning Moloch. <laughs> Goodbye. Good money. I did beat your salamander. I'm sorry. Will you make me a trident now? <laughs> <laughs> Uh, <laughs> that's pretty good. I do love a low, low res explosion. That it, that's a very <laughs> Toby Foxian thing. Oh, that was cool as hell. I'm an addict. Yeah, the grandma is way more interested in who the hell I am. Yeah. <laughs> Look, I gave it my best shot. <laughs> I'm gonna befriend him. Yeah, sorry, Briggs. Fight your own battles, buddy. I mean, he already lost to me, so. And that was like. Uh, 17 levels ago? Yeah. Like level 10 or something? I am a monster, it's true. <laughs> wow, the, the granny guilt mode here. <laughs> I don't think that's gonna work a but second time. But my child! No, it always does. <laughs> <laughs> Grandma can't help herself. Can oh. we just chat? Oh, hey, everyone. Yeah, we're fine. <laughs> we're gonna rat him out. We're rat him out to his grandmother. She's gonna kick his ass. No, I'm... Okay, point of order. He bought the ship from Alhafra with stolen goods. It's very slightly different. But we do hate Alhafra, so, like, it's important that we bring this up. It's true. But Grandma... Grandma. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, maybe we should mention that. We don't care. Can you make us a trident? I do love if we had been just able to talk about this, we would have been fine. <laughs> this all could have been avoided. Yeah, fuck that guy. Th that's kind of the summary of most of this, these two games' plots. Like, yes. This yeah. could have been avoided if we talked about it. Oh, well, there I, she goes. I, I, regularly re I remember that there's like a bit of justification here that uh, he only stole jewels, which means he basically only stole from the rich, but also they kind of occasionally mentioned that he stole food too from them, <laughs> which like, food is for everyone though. Yup. And gems, the food, yup. Told you we'd ram out to his nan. <laughs> she, would, she would kick his ass. <laughs> You're going in the pit, Briggs. <laughs> yes. Why would they lie? <laughs> uh, Granny knows what I, he's about. I do remember that uh, 
Alright, well, I will not give uh, too many compliments to the writing of these. I do remember liking Obaba a lot, actually. Yes. <laughs> She's a fun grandma. All you can really ask for, fun grandma. Well, because you're all starving. Uh... If only we had arable land. You did? I... Hmm. But you stole a boat to do it. No, we stole the goods to get the boat, and then we paid for the goods. No, you did not find those jewels. You <laughs> stole them. You are gonna bring the wrath of God. <laughs> where, where did you find them? In rich people's houses? I, mean, I guess that does count. Don't count. We were pirates until you found the jewels. So you did steal- okay, so the jewels weren't stolen, They although, were located. We have really, uh, no leg to stand on, because we steal jewels from ruins constantly, and that is, in fact, uh, theft, but- Well, yeah, but also, you do it for saving the world reasons. <laughs> we also earned that last gem. True. We were better than all of his students. <laughs> he gave us that book as well. That statue guy. True, statue dude that said that we also earned it. I don't believe you, but okay. <laughs> Briggs is like, no, 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 absolutely not. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> He's like, I was, I was lying to impress the wife. Oh yeah. Oh sure. yeah. Okay. Now that you mention it, <laughs> I did say that directly to you and only you. I want to point out that there's a layering problem where Creighton's actually. Yes, Creighton is. We've been having some layering problems today. I don't know if we've been having them. So I much, think, but Shahua also didn't come through the door yes, uh, correctly. Like I said, like, today we've been having them, and I'm not. I'm not sure we've been having them before. Maybe I we think just that it notice. is just part of not making the world map wiggle. Yeah, like definitely that. All right. And it's better do, that the world map doesn't wiggle. Do we forgive Briggs or Nay? It might make his grand mad at him if we say no. <laughs> I want his nut to kick his ass. <laughs> no, I don't forgive him. No, oh, oh, we disagreed with Creighton, so that's perfect. Oh, that's fine then. <laughs> that's fine. <laughs> we just want to make old people mad, apparently. Hey, hey, no, I explicitly said I don't forgive you. Hey, well, we're getting hey. some trusty patches going in here. <laughs> Maybe Kraynan is just now. kicking her head. <laughs> you can forgive me, right? <laughs> we're, 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 straight, uh, we're thick as thieves now, aren't we? <laughs> Come on. Come on, Governor. Wait, what? I think he's ill now? Oh, his grand can't okay. beat him up? Uh -huh, uh -huh. Uh -huh. That guy has been voicing Patches since 2009 now. That's a 13 year long role. <laughs> Pretty nice. wild, yes. <laughs> and he's always been very trusty. She is doing her best so that his grand doesn't beat him up. I know. As he thoroughly deserves, though. <laughs> ah, I guess we're just gonna let him walk out of here. Bye. It's Idiot. a good thing the mayor of that town is such a dick that we don't feel like we want to bring yes, him to justice. that we don't want to be cops for him. Yeah. Uh, we have trident pieces for some reason. Can you free up two of our inventory slots, please? I don't- three, yeah. Well, I guess we'll have the trident. We're getting an yeah, item. Yeah, so yeah, just two. But, like, we don't really have a reason for this trident. We're just getting it. <laughs> She's even like, oh, you don't have a reason. Got it. And we, we do have a reason. We have all three pieces. Make us a trident, please. I don't know if we have to- Oh, yeah, there we go. We just laid one in front of her. Just yep. Just we just threw it, down. it on the ground. <laughs> Done by not speaking, just throws it on the ground and stares at her expectantly like a dog returning a so, like a stick. If you don't know what you're doing with the whole thing, this is, I think, the very first time that the game will ever tell you. 
there was that one NPC that was like, hey, if you want to kill uh, Poseidon, you need to try to... Yeah, if you mind-read him. But, like, in terms of critical path... But also, we have no reason to expect we will see Poseidon. This is also true. Uh, maybe there's an NPC or a book somewhere that's like, hey, if you want to get to Lemura, you'll have to get past the King of the Sea. I do think at least the guy said that Poseidon used to be the Sea King and now he's crazy. That's, that's it. Up until now, this is the only time in the entire game thus far that it's like, hey, maybe you should go find these trident bits. Magnificent. So I have successfully managed to put going to Lemuria for the kids' words on you. On me, yes. He's been playing hot potato with it this entire time. <laughs> Wondering who would get to bite that bullet. We sure oh, that's did. gonna be rough if you're not if you're uh, like unfamiliar with doing the analog inputs here. We'll make it work. Mm -hmm. Probably. Oh, uh, it's gonna be funny. It's gonna be good. <laughs> I like it. It's gonna be hilarious. This is exactly how fortune works. Oh, oh yeah. That's funny. But, uh, I just had to give it a minute. It's fine. I mean, Granny, you're the one who threw it in the pit. I thought you would know. That's not how this normally works. It's... I'm sorry, this fire is so magnificent. I'm just... <laughs> oh, the sound effect ended! <laughs> <laughs> Didn't expect you to hold on this cool fire for very long, huh? <laughs> uh, who's gonna reach out and grab it? It's fine. Me, I'll grab it. Uh, how do, how do I grab yep, yep, it? How do we do that? It's, Think about it's it. Reveal. Nope, it's the usual. Yeah, it's always reveal. All right. Yeah, okay. Well, again, this is how we talked about, like, reveal, like, I was like, how does it get down? How does she throw things down there if there's this in the way? But it's not until you reveal. Yes, it's, it's a pit. It's a hole in the ground until you reveal that there's some platform up there. No matter what you encounter at sea, anywhere else, it's useless. So the uh, the trident is a actually quite powerful uh, attack item, basically, yes. that you can use repeatedly. You can use it on anything, but there is someone who you absolutely must use it on. Uh, equipping it does literally nothing. And yeah, it, it, you can't, I was just wondering. It <laughs> yeah, it can't break or anything. It's just you're able to equip it just because. I was like, is it gonna we play fast and loose over something? Nope, but it's no. in the trident slot. It's just that uh, an equip. I'm not sure who we want it on to like actually attack in the fight. It might be Alvis because he doesn't really have much to do most of the time. Yeah, it's like, probably so a slow, ring. But, uh, yeah, it probably is. Yeah. Well, yeah, we don't actually have a ring equipped. I guess we could actually. Like, check it. This is the most important thing in the entire stream. I'm curious. I do need to sell this mace uh, that we got. This cursed mace that is not oh. stronger than any of the weapons we have. Oh, no, you can equip okay. it once in a ring. So, uh, all right, I actually just looked this up. There's an uh, it, unspoken actual benefit of equipping it, turns out. It makes it increases your mercury resistance by 20, turns out. Oh. Oh. That's it all it does, that so thing. it's not that big of a deal. Yeah, the ring is like this slot. That's right, right. right. Yeah. And weirdly enough, when you use it, it actually converts your attack, the attack yeah. into Jupiter damage. So, wins. sure. <laughs> that's weird. All right. Like, I guess it kind of makes sense for the fight that you're meant to use it in, but weird. Yeah, yeah, that does work. Pretty decent on uh, Dumba then, or on a healer for some water. All right, where's the inn in this town? We'll finish up there. A fascinating question. I think it's outside the caves. Yeah, I like, think. Like, right outside yeah. them. Caves are so huge. God, so you know how that uh, Avamander had, like, a decent amount of health and it still took, like, took a bit to just kind of chew through it? Sure. Uh, Poseidon has over a thousand more. That sounds right. That's so, your uh, problem. Look forward Poseidon. to that. Tuesday. Yeah, 
Poseidon is going to be, uh, I mean, it's not that rough in that none of the fights, except from the extra ones, are, like, super, super rough, but it's definitely, like, I, I think Poseidon is, like, generally one of the hardest fights in this game. Yes, it is, it is a jump compared to, like, what we've been doing so far in the game. Yeah, because, like, it's the guaranteed, oh, you have to do this last part yeah. so they can actually yeah. make it hard again. Yes, everything here has kind of been sitting at the same early to mid-20s levels, and we're finally about to move past that. All right, well, uh, that'll actually be our next stream because I'm not streaming tomorrow. Yes, I'm not tomorrow, streaming with George's uh, Mask, so. non-stream. Yep, so, yeah, next stream will actually be Tuesday. It'll be more more Golden Sun. We'll get into Lemuria. I'll try and guide Vickis through uh, the ocean. <laughs> There's going to be some motion in the ocean come Tuesday. I'm going to use those children's lyrics and try and guide you through. And it'll go great. It will go terribly. <laughs> it's going to be it. We're going to fail at least once is my prediction. Mm -hmm. All right. I can't wait for it. <laughs> <laughs> we will see you then. Uh, I guess one more thing uh, I just want to announce is that I uh, I revamped my cross stitch commission yes. page on Twitter, and we're gonna be in the UK nice. for uh, basically all of April. Uh, so if you're in the UK and you always want to cross stitch, but the fifteen dollar international shipping price put you off, uh, it will be a lot cheaper because I'll ship it from. The UK, it'll be like four pounds. So uh, if you want to hit me up for uh, for a cross stitch, limited time, of course, because you know, I will be leaving the UK at the end of April. But hey, it's an opportunity. All right, see you all on Tuesday. Bye, everyone. Bye bye. Bye bye.